hey guys are welcome you to my channel in this video as this i bring to you another reaction video and this time around it's a lyric video from rude boy the title is oga oga that recently i i have been seeing the news that like there has there has been protests demonstrations all over yeah saying uh NSAS now NSAS blah 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 but an NSAS is like a unit in their military or police force that check crime and other things but like the civilians are saying that they harass them, they embarrass them in public places. Like, it's not, it's not nice at all. Yeah, yeah. So we are going to react to Root Boy's uh, song. He released it during this protest uh, time. So I don't know if it's going to concern uh, NSAS now protest or like what it's about. Let's get into the lyrics video and see what he's trying to tell us. Whoa. Rudy kill us with music yeah. Yeah. So make them lead us Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder what? Like, oh my god, like the beat The beat at the background is like Very hot uh, it's Like, oh my goodness, you can't really dance to it Why you be say everything just they go down We get government, they just they slow down The same government, let them they go down Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder Why you be say everything just they go down Sometimes you don't understand African leaders like Sometimes I don't I don't get them. See, like these guys they make money from politics or even governors for their personal gain, right? So at least a lot of people to enjoy small, like they will be the civilians will be like we want this, we want that, but like for them to do that, unless it's getting closer to election, like I don't sometimes I don't get this. I mean, the uh, wrong hands of politicians or government. Like, oh my God, I don't really get it. Government, let them they go down. Hey. Election no reach, election no reach. It's all about more they money. Hey. And if they succeed, and if they succeed, you see say that they might breed. So why you see say bag of rice and carry just to flow anyhow? Cause they hunger with the impulse, so you they kill you anyhow. And forget their humanity, they show you animosity. Use our diversity, scatter our unity. Oh God. Yeah, like like this this is basically um concerning sounds and like the brutality the like like the things happening in Nigeria like child labor like child trafficking and all those things like the poverty is just too much it's not only Nigeria but like across Africa like you don't know what's wrong with the leaders you vote them to power that's all when they succeed by winning votes forget Show you what make we tip the ballot box. Oh God, show you what make we scatter the votes. Oh God, show you what rule. Like some youth in Africa, it's not like they don't want to vote again or they want to vote again. Like the woman they get to the ballot box, like they will just for the vote because they don't see the essence of, uh, of them voting. Like basically, like they don't see the essence of them voting. So they go there and they support the ballot <clears throat> because they don't see any development from the government. So why should they either vote for them or against it? Just like before, yeah. yeah. So listen attentively. Now under one condition, make you bring your daughter and she go lead us. Bring your mother and she go lead us. You know be your mother, you know go deceive us. Oh God, now them go lead us. So bring your daughter and she go lead us. Bring your mother and she go lead us. You know be your mother, you know go deceive us. Oh God, now them go lead us. Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder why you be say everything just they go down. We get government, so just they slow down. The same. Government, let them they go down. Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder why you be say everything just they go down. We get government, they just they slow down. The same government, let them they go down. Yeah, them go chop money, they set up committee. They go send all of the children overseas. Like, I don't get it. Like, see, the politicians will spend the money, they will spend the state money, they will misuse it, they will mishandle it. And now they set up a committee to look into it. When they when they are doing that, you get to see that oh they've set up a committee that oh this politician has spent this money blah 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 blah. But the end result will never be seen. Like I don't get it. Like what's wrong? What's up? Then go build a spirit where we don't see. Hold up, I'm on a die you. 
We know me and the radical. We know no physical. Speaking so political. Life is very critical. Killing don't talk to cinema. Chilling don't talk to vigilant. Now who be the criminal? Them be sassin' over. One day we go rise up. Why you? That day we go rise. I like. I I I I heard that. Um, the south in Nigeria, like when they see a youth like below, I think below 24 or 21, like when they see you with laptop, iPhone, or like Porsche cars, like they be like, Where did you get the money to buy those things? And I'm asking myself, So if you are at that age, it doesn't mean like you can't be successful or what? I don't know where they, they got that quote from, like to be a successful man, you need to be 45 going or something. I don't get it. Some people just work hard, and I mean, some people get. Naturally, they are they are from rich home, so any small support they get, like they are able to buy their own things. So I don't get it why you see every successful young man as a uh, Yahoo boy or soccer boy. Like I don't get that. Like that's the only thing I hate about the SARS demonstration or like what's going on. Why should you assume that a young guy shouldn't own an iPhone or a tablet or like a, a, a laptop? Why? What's wrong? So it's only a god that they can use iPhone and. Like it doesn't make sense. Even with your pythons, all of them, all of them go side us. Oh God, sure you won't make with if the ballot box. Oh God, sure you won't make with scatter the votes. Oh God, sure you won't rule us like before. So listen attentively. Now under one condition, make you bring your daughter and she go lead us. Bring your mother and she. Sometimes I sense revolution in like some African states. In Nigeria, person like I sense revolution. Like, like sometimes I don't know these politicians. If they don't study things. So I was like, in the past, in the old days, like these things were happening and that brought up revolution and like conflict and wars. And I don't know why these politicians still don't learn from that because they're probably like. They will be quiet this time around, but like some years to come, like centuries to come, it will evolve revolution. Like seriously, this thing, like if they don't end it now, if they don't end this house now, it can turn into revolution and rout and conflict and war. Like seriously, they might think it's a joke. Go lead us, we know be your mark and you know go deceive us. Oh God, now them go lead us. So bring your daughter and she go lead us. Bring your mother and she go lead us. We know be your mark and you know go deceive us. Oh God, now them go lead us. Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder why you be say everything just they go there. We get government, they just they slow there. The same government, now them they go there. Sometimes I wonder, wonder, wonder why you be say everything just they go there. We get government, they just they slow there. The same government, now them they go there. Yeah. And SARS and police brutality are yeah, like basically like oh my god. So my guessing was right, like or oh, this or god thing is 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 a song for the protest, like you have to be playing it all day in Nigeria and every part of Africa. And SARS now and police brutality. You don't know you know they won't see that. Yeah. yeah, so that's it from Rude Boy and like this me I don't I don't really get problem with politicians because mm -hmm. I don't fit anything from them like I don't I'm like I don't benefit from politicians or like government like my parents don't get government people like I don't really benefit from them even they get government people or not like you are politicians so what should I do? You understand? So I don't I don't really get it why like like you come and lead the people you do you, you tell the people that you have this uh, capability to lead them to govern them to make the economy nice and blah 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 with them. those kind of things they speak now you come to power the people are demanding for this you don't want to do it for them the people are demanding that they need peace they need harmony they need good economy they need good leadership and then they it will turn to something else. And when you go to some country, like even the government has turned into friends and family. Like, like I don't get it. 
like friends and family, how are you going to check corruption? Like, how are you going to check corruption? If your cousin is like minister of, like a minister of finance and like there's corruption there, how can you check that? How can you arrest your own cousin? Like, doesn't make sense. Recently, I saw, uh, I think, uh, Buhari makes uh, the assistant uh, a, a commissioner of what do you call it, election or whatever. Like, these things, like, this should tell us that, like, our leaders, they are just playing with our mind and they think they are smart. It's just uh, like, this is the beginning of corruption. Like, seriously, the beginning of corruption. I don't understand why these old folks, they see some of us to be fools, so, like, we are not reasonable. The way they govern countries, like, it shows clearly that they are cheating us. They are very old, but, like, they are cheating the youth, right? If you're going to say this to, like, you be like, you don't like the government, but, like, why should I hate a president from my country? Like, why? On what reason should I hate a president? Like, on what reasons? So, if the people are demanding for this, you know the road to a particular place is not good, the hospital is not good, the people are telling you the road is not good, the hospital is not good, and you are sitting there. And you want me to be laughing at you and be happy with you that, oh, you are the president. So, like, I don't get it. These old folks, like, sometimes I sit there and be like, so these people, they are fighting for their family or they are fighting for the country. Like, oh my God. Yeah, so that's a nice song from um, Rude Boy concerning the sad. Like, I really like artists who engage themselves in, like, things that are happening in their countries. Yeah, I really like that. And the song is really nice. I don't want to talk more about, like, it being a song for parties or like the song is really good but like since you're in the era of NSAS 9 brutality we support nigerians with that agenda yeah anything that will go against nigeria it will affect us yeah we africa other african countries because we know some of these countries do international trade yeah like the the buying and selling goes on like within this country so like Anything that will affect Nigeria, basically will affect Ghana, will affect Togo, like because if there's war now, buying and selling will go on. Yeah, the economy is going to affect not only Nigeria but other countries that they trade with Nigeria. So guys, that's a nice song from uh, Root Boy and I would like to end my reaction to this song here. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do me a favor by subscribing to my channel, like my videos share also and don't forget to tell me your mind in the comment section tell me anything you want to tell me in the comment section and recommend any song you want me to react to it in my next video so until i see my next video peace out